How are you guys? Welcome to today's edition of Programming Wizards. Today I'm going to talk to you about radio buttons. So please start up your Visual Studio. Let's come create a new project. Let's create a new okay. Let's name our project uh, intro to buttons to radio buttons. Intro to radio buttons. Okay. It's loading. Okay, here we have our form. So please, uh, the first thing, let's change some few properties of the form. Yeah, let me put radio buttons demo. Okay, then I'll be using uh, group box to group the radio buttons. So please drag the group box to the form. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here is my group box. I'll change its property to. Uh, Choose your agenda. It will prompt the user to choose his or her agenda. Okay. Then I'll drag two radio buttons uh, and bring them to the form. Uh -huh. This is the first one. Copy paste it. Okay. I have there two radio buttons. You can change their properties. Uh, this one I'll call female. And then the name of the radio button will be female radio. This one's name will be male radio. It will be mail. Okay. So, actually, what the program is going to do is that when somebody clicks the button, it will show us. Okay, he or she will choose the gender. Then it will display in a text in in. It will display it in a, in a, in a message box. So this one I'll say choose 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 Button Okay Then click the button Let's go to the code uh, I don't need this one here But I'll just leave it alone Okay so no, if I want to remove it, mm, I'll come here, I'll select, then I'll go to the events, okay, I'll delete it from the events, okay, it's no longer here now, okay, so, the first method that I need is a method to display, text so I'll say private void display it will take a string of texts and that is what it will display
it will display the text okay this is just a helper method then I'll need the method for choosing choose the agenda method okay so uh, it will be a private void choose gender okay so the first thing that I'll do is that I'll determine the gender chosen so I'll say if okay we want to determine the gender that has been chosen so we'll come here and say if um, well radio dot checked is equal to true display to shorten things then this one instead of male it will be female if female radio checked is equal to true is equal to you are female okay let's run the program and see or um, yeah let's implement the method choose yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, we have our method. So, this one, uh, if we click choose your male, okay, working perfect. Female, if you choose your female, okay. So, thank you, guys. This was just an intro to uh, combo, uh, an intro to the deal buttons. So I hope you've enjoyed the tutorial. See you next time.